finally out how exciting is this uh subnautica below zero a huge fan of subnautica i actually played the first time i played subnautica the original was on a 24-hour stream and i think i played it for like two hours and i just never wanted to stop i like i just wanted to keep going for the rest of the 24-hour stream it was that like late at night and i was like man this game is fucking sick so uh i've played through subnautica a number of times i played through it a first time uh that was my was figuring stuff out second time i played through it on a hardcore mode where like i couldn't like if you die once that's just it your your run is over and i played through it a third time with a mod that made the game like harder so i've played through the original subnautica three times i've never played below zero i've never played this and it should be pretty exciting i'm excited i can't wait we're gonna be going uh hardcore mode for a our first time yeah we're going hardcore mode our first time <laughs> Survival mode with only one life, no O2 alerts. Uh, that's gonna be fun. Uh, Crooked Man, thank you for 11 months. Eight pound, thank you for the gift sub. DZ, Dan of London, uh, P Sam, Metal Stoofs, Stitch Bucket, Rich Heavy, White Moth, thank you for all the resubs, guys. John on the spot, thank you for the gift sub. Uh, Kilo Predator, thank you for the bits. Omnimorphic, Keys Keys, Deflated Pear, Gall, Gallon of Truth. Thank you for all the resubs, guys. Thank you very much. All right. Uh, well, let's get it on. Let's do it. Let's see. Do I, I have a I have a timer here. Let me move my. Where is my timer? We'll probably use the timer to. Uh, let's see. Where is it? We'll probably use the timer to uh, count deaths or something, or like at least like, will I die in the next hour? We'll do some shit like that. We'll see. We'll see what we can figure out. Yeah, we're going hardcore. We're going hardcore. All right, let's do it. Hardcore. Subnautica. Let's do it. Like a cool little planet. Keep a little loading zone. Uh, RM Hansen, thanks for the 42 months. Ditch McGee, thank you for 10 gift subs. All right, shut up. Shut up, guys. T-Bone, thank you for the four months. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Thank you, Ditch. All right. So are we gonna be crashing on this planet? I have no idea. Let's see, everybody, all right, shut up, shut up, shut up, everybody shut up. This is the farthest that I can take you on company space bucks, Robin. You sure you want this? The research is in everything. It is to me and Sam. We need to know what happened. The meteor storm. Like moving? I can use it for cover from Altera's eyes. <sighs> gonna miss you, Robin. Hmm. I'll find my way back. So we're like sneaking onto the planet and Altera doesn't want us here. Is that what it is? Interesting. Okay. Our character's name is Robin, I guess. All right, neat. Is Sam the character from the first game? Yeah, the music's banging. Oh, it's not, okay. Did the character in the first game even have a name? Did we even have a name in the first game? I don't know if we did. John F. Subnautica. Uh, we're playing? Now we're all oh, now we're playing. Enjoy, enjoy your stay. Oh my god, look at my hands while I run. That's weird. I don't remember that from the first one. All right, enjoy our stay. Well, I see something uh, is launching there. All right, hang, hang on, hang on. Holy shit. Why, why don't we wait? Why don't we wait? Profit. Thank you for 100 gift subs. Profit, thank you so much. Holy crap. Thank if you, you so much. I'll shove a lightning bolt up your ass. No game only thing. I know you guys are really excited. You guys may be more excited than me. Uh, Prophet, thank you so much. Atwa, Wadiga, X Ray Cat, Dam, thank you for the resubs. Thank you so much, Prophet, for 100 gift subs. Holy crap. Thank you so much. Uh, that's insane. Thank you very, very much. Scooby Snacks, Log Dog, thank you for the resubs. Thank you guys very much. I really appreciate that. Thank you guys. Okay. All right, let's get back in the game. Profit, thank you so much. That's just insane. Thank you very much. All right. 
Let's see, we have a shadow. Yeah. Oh, there's like a temperature. Is that a temperature? 80? Whoa. Holy uh, smokes. That did not go as planned. I should find a way into the water and get to the drop pod. All right, so that, I, I guess we're going to keep heading over there. These plants that are looking at me, I don't I don't like them. <laughs> I don't trust them. Okay, let's see what else we got. Uh, thank you again, Prophet. Uh, eight pound thanks to the gift sub. Thank you, guys. All right, so it looks like the game wants me to go into the water. Uh, okay. Uh, I wonder, is, is my temperature going to massively drop off if I jump in the water here? Like, maybe I don't want to. Maybe I want to platform across. <laughs> Am I playing, like, Mario Galaxy here? Oh, it actually made my temperature go up. Is the water warmer than the air? I feel like it must be. Eat the penguin. Get the penguin and eat it. <laughs> Cook it. <laughs> All right, let's keep heading towards this, I guess. The water is always above freezing. I guess so. All right. Ooh, pretty. Oh, that peeper. Grab it. Grab the peeper. New oh, we... creature discovered. Oh, is that a new voice for the robot lady? I think it is. Uh oh, new let's... Blueprint synthesized. Oh, I don't have to worry about the bends anymore. <laughs> I was like, oh shit, the bends. I don't think I have to worry about the bends anymore. <laughs> As I was going up, I was like, oh my god, I'm going to get the bends. I don't think I got to worry about that anymore. <laughs> Found the drop pod. All right. My home away from home. Okay, let's see. Well, Sam, I guess I might as well gather some tools and resources before starting my search. Hope that radio tower is as easy to spot as Lil said. Okay, well, just like Subnautica 1, we are a hungry and thirsty bitch. Just, just like Subnautica 1, we have no food. Alright, I like how you don't have the life pot in this one. Well, let's go quickly find a fish to eat. I feel like they improved the uh, animations of the fish, don't you think? Looks like the fish are actually like, it looks more like they're swimming now, which is kind of cool. Is it chop? Hang on, is it choppy? Oh no. Okay, it looks like my encoding is overloaded. Uh, hang on one second. Maybe. Yeah, I think maybe we can fix that. Hang on, let's uh, save and quit. Sorry, right, we need to. Uh, I need to adjust my audio settings. Yeah, I'm playing on PC. Uh, let's see. Advanced detail. Sorry, the the it's a little bit choppy. Let's try to fix that up. Weather quality, anti-aliasing. I guess should I, should I just lower some of this shit, maybe? Turn off motion blur. Yeah, probably, right? Motion blur just off. The seas can be choppy. Go medium. I wonder what I would I go medium on what, I guess. Water quality, skybox. Yeah, we turn off the motion blur. What what else though? This plays well in handheld mode. It's fine now. Check V-Sync. Do you see V-Sync here? Am I am I just not seeing it? On Taco Bell sauce. Ambient occlusion. Something I like about Total War is it literally tells you what every everything does. Tells you what everything does. I guess I could turn this down to medium, right? Okay. Let's see if that's any better. You can play this on full settings on an art, but you're not streaming. So while streaming is very resource intensive. Okay, let's see if this is going to remove the chop. Hopefully it does. Turn off bloom. Well, we can always save and quit. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. I'm sorry if it was initially choppy. I'm sorry about that, guys. Oh, yeah. Timer. We'll start the timer. Let's see. How is this? Is this good? Smooth now. We get. I'm not seeing any encoding overloaded. Much better. Nah, it's still doing it. It's still doing. It. I just saw it. Okay, like butter. Nah, still saw a little bit of chop there. Ah, let's turn some stuff down. Sorry about this, guys. I know. This is the. This is how PC gaming is so great. I love PC gaming. Who doesn't fucking love it? 
I don't even know what that means. What does that mean? What is this? What did the hell is ambient occlusion? What the hell does that mean? This is, does anybody know? Turn then preset to medium. Just preset medium. Oh my god, what was that low setting? <laughs> I mean, I want... I want high quality water. We'll just turn off motion blur. Okay, let's try this. Maybe this will be better. I want... It's a game about water. I have a really powerful PC. I want good water. I want some high quality H2O. Ambient occlusion is shading. Just like global shading and lighting. Okay. Okay, now hopefully this... I'm not seeing any warnings right now. I'm gonna... My first death on hardcore mode is gonna be because I was doing this. It seems... Perfect. It seems good. Yeah, okay. All right, I think we're good now. I think we're good. All right. All right. Well, I think our first thing here is let's make some food. Success. Yeah, just the, the joys of PC gaming. I like to just pl I like to just set it, just play it, set it, and forget it. I don't want to have to worry about Oh, wow. You open up your menu so much faster now. <laughs> You open it up way faster than you did in Subnautica 1. Okay, let's see. Fiber mesh. Creep vine. So there's going to be creep vine somewhere. We got glass. Copper wire. Make some batteries. I don't think we've seen a ribbon plant yet. It's sustenance. Okay, we definitely want to make an O2 tank for sure. So we need two titanium and a fiber mesh. So we're going to have to find creep vine. Uh, what about a knife? Okay. Okay. Uh, thank you for the bits. Appreciate it. Uh, I don't, I'm not going to read that. Spoiler in the bits. Yeah, well, that's why That's why TTS. All right, so we want titanium. We want rubber. We need to find creep vine, it seems like. There must be creep vine nearby, I feel like. Oh, we found a sea glide already. I mean, I don't know. Unless they want me to go back to the surface already, right? Hmm. I, I can I have to remember I can go back to the surface. I have to really remember that. Bullseye shrooms. Ah, <laughs> uh, looks at that. It's, ooh, pretty. Oh, I thought I saw a jellyfish. I was gonna be like, oh, don't swim into that. Okay, look, we're finding some resources already. Should be able to use this. I hope she doesn't. Not. I have no problem with her. With, it, with the character being a female or anything like that. I just hope she doesn't talk too much. Because she's already talking like... We've already said more things in this game than we ever did in Subnautica 1. I hope she doesn't talk too much. <laughs> we never spoke. We never spoke in Subnautica 1. I feel like it's easier to get immersed when you're not talking all the time. Can't... Yeah, right? Uh, rabbit, please. Oh, where is their fucking creep vine? There isn't. Is, is this creep vine? There's no way this is considered creep vine, right? Yeah, I don't know what this is. I'm hearing some large roaring. I don't think I have to worry about getting about getting killed here or not. I think it's a little. I think it's a little early. This is probably the. Uh, I would imagine this is like the equivalent of the safe shallows here. I'd imagine. I could be wrong. What is this game about? Water. Pretty much. I live inside of a Pokeball. <laughs> it's never too early to die. I was a little nervous about dropping into an unknown area, but luckily, this biome seems to have an abundance of minerals I See, can use for tools and upgrades. I don't like that. I didn't want another situation like Byzantos 5. When Xenoworks dropped me off, there were barely any resources. I survived off the land for three months with just a knife, my lucky PDA, and some rope. I am still kind of proud of that, though. <laughs> it's kind of annoying. Uh, let's see. Silicone were uninstall. <laughs> so I still don't, I don't have anything. I can't make anything. We need to find creep vine. Where the hell is there? 
Creep vine for rub. Oh, there we go. I think that's I think that's creep vine. Okay. Oh, I think we found some. Okay, okay, okay. We got it. So I guess creep vine is just all over this planet, huh? Ooh, this looks so. This looks so good compared to Subnautica One. Holy crap! So are we looking for the clusters here? Man, this looks good. Check audio options and switch the voice off. Literally unplayable. It's kind of nerve wracking that when I'm above, I can't see like shit. It's kind of nerve wracking. It's just like a pure snowstorm up there. Okay. The lighting looks good. Oh yeah, this looks great. Subnautica 1 also looked good. It also, okay, there we go. Okay, this is what we needed. New blueprint synthesized. I kind of miss the the vo the robot lady from the first one. Those are big ass tentacles, aren't they? Okay, let's head back. Man, I'm so excited for this game. You know, Subnautica One taught me to fear these caves. <laughs> I don't know if I want to rush into one of those caves. I hate this game. Confirmed? Nah, nah, I don't hate this game. Yeah, the lighting is amazing, yeah. Already got the blueprint for lube. Hell yeah, man. I think, yeah, this is the same planet. Yeah, it's the same planet. Okay, well, we definitely need rubber, right? Let's do that. Light on pegging. <laughs> we also need fiber mesh. We definitely need that. Oh, well, I need it. So I, the first thing I need to make then is a knife because we have to cut. Okay. Take the knife. And let's just make a bunch more rubber, uh, I guess. You could also make some lube, I guess. Why not? Silicone and lube. Name a more, name a more dynamic duo. Uh, all right. We're already, of course, it's Subnautica. We are already thirsty and hungry. I always feel like you get hungry and thirsty just a little too fast in this game. <laughs> Want coffee with that rubber and lube? I always have coffee while I have rubber and lube. Here, make some lube. The fries, thirst, hunger, oxygen. Yeah, I know, right? Uh, let's see. So we can all, oh, we can also make fins because we made two rubber. Okay, let's do that. Yeah, I don't usually get hungry every 15 seconds. Not typically. Okay, so we have knife and we have fins. Okay, let's go get that creep vine sample. Oh, I thought, I thought that was a warper. What is this? Can I eat you? A sea monkey. All right. If you ever unsubscribe, I'll shove a lightning bolt up your ass. New blueprint synthesized. I'll cut you! Some of the wildlife down here is very grabby. Oi! <laughs> stole my knife <laughs> all right it looks like they can the sea monkeys can fucking take your shit back up you're too close uh kuragamo thank you for the 22 months cakey streams thank you for the, the five months <laughs> fucking knife them all right fiber mesh what are you gonna do take my knife <laughs> All right, let's make our oxygen tank, all right? Uh, Illa Vanilla, thank you for the uh, nine months. Thank you, Illa Vanilla. I appreciate how fast the menus are. The menus in this game are, oh, it actually shows you how long your shit lasts now. That's really cool. That's a nice change. VIP breathing. Don't bring a knife to a monkey fight. All right, we definitely want a scanner. We want a scanner, we need to make a battery. We also probably want a repair tool. Wow, crystalline sulfur for a repair tool? That must be in the, that must, nah, we probably gotta go into a cave for that. Uh, Anerson, thanks to the $5, thank you, Anerson. Okay, so scanner will be our next priority. 
So we're looking for batteries. We need, I don't know what ribbon plants are. I don't know what they are. Because you can pin recipes. Oh, look at that. So if you pin a recipe in the top right corner, you can like see what you have and what you need. That's really cool. Okay. That's a nice, that's a nice change for sure. Like that change. I feel like they made the fish a little slower so they're easier to catch. Like, look at these fish. It would make sense because we're in cold weather, right? So the fish are more lethargic in the cold. Doesn't that kind of make sense? I feel like it makes sense. Yeah, it's a cool feature. Or they're sleeping. Is it? Oh, maybe it's because of nighttime? Yeah, maybe. Fish are cold blooded. Were they really fast on death run? No, I don't think that was it. All right, we're already fucking hungry because of course we are. How does water not go in the base when she opens the door? How do, more like, how does she not die of the bends constantly? And <laughs> the, the eating and drinking noises, my wife would hate this game. She'd be like, ugh, stop it. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think my wife would be down with that. Okay, so I don't know what the fuck a ribbon plant is. I don't know what a ribbon plant is. I don't think, there's no way this is a ribbon plant, right? Okay, not a ribbon plant. At least we can breathe a little bit more. Uh, that, that, maybe that's a ribbon plant. It kind of looks like that on the menu being pinned. Whoa, it is a fucking woo, 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 woo up there. Woo, 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 woo. Eddie Graff, thank you for the 43 months. Thank you, Eddie Graff. Aha, oh. Plants contain electrolytic materials that can be used in energy storage. Okay. All right. Is Subnautica possible in third person? Uh, maybe with a mod. I don't know. With modding, perhaps. I've, I've never seen a third person Subnautica mod. I don't think this game would work very well in third person. Because you need to be more... You have to aim. Uh, aim and pick up fish everywhere. Oh, are those? Hmm, there's some plants over there. Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, let's try to find a few more ribbon plants. I think we need two before we head back. I'm liking the music. I'm liking the music. This is going to be a great work day. Uh, a little nervous. Okay. I definitely hear like distant roaring or moaning. There's definitely something in the distance. I got a piece of that shroom, whatever that is. I feel like this would be fun in VR. Moaning is me. Ah, here we go. Yeah, give me all this stuff. There we go. Uh, Tesseracts, thank you for the gift set. Thank you, Tesseracts. Oh, maybe it's... I don't know if it's the penguins or not. Probably not, right? Uh, thank you, Tesseract. So it looks like when you're on the surface, there's like a temperature meter. Like how when you're in the water, there's an oxygen meter. So it looks like you have to balance those out, I guess. Kind of cool. Does it make sense? Since it's apparently really fucking cold here, right? Cook a penguin. Yeah, can we eat the penguins? All right, let's make some batteries. Batteries are good. I probably shouldn't have used all my copper there, honestly. But it's all right. Okay, scanner is number one. Scanner, good. Uh, it's your boy Kratos. Thank you for the 13 months. All right, I have a scanner. <laughs> I, d I don't really understand the need. Now comes a scanner. Every xenobiologist's favorite tool. This planet has some fascinating flora and fauna. I can't wait to learn about them. This will also give me access to a greater tool set. I'm assuming Altera left behind tech that I can scan for blueprints. That should make surviving and exploring out here a bit easier. Don't worry, Sam. I haven't forgotten I'm here for you. But so who is Sam? A little research on the side, right? I know you would have done the same. I will find out what happened to you. I promise. I feel like... So I, I'm liking the game so far. I don't really care for the narration. I feel like it's kind of, I don't know. 
don't really care for the, the narration so far. Now let's get this piece of sea glide. Pink narrow leaf. Bullseye shrimp. Let's scan everything. Scan everything ever. Scaly maw anemone. Ooh, what is this? A Galena outcrop. Okay, it looks like it just gives you the same shit as a, ty as a limestone outcrop. <laughs> Nemony spotted. Scan everything. Moist Muff, Sir Crow. Thank you for the resubs. Holy crap. Pleasure. I guess I don't have to scan you, huh? Coral Bridge. Interesting. Can I knife? Nope. Uh, Fleasure. Thank you for the 10 gift subs. Thank you, Fleasure. I really appreciate that. Thank you very much. Ooh, found another piece of sea glide here. Uh, thank you very much, Fleasure. I appreciate that. Mo Funk, thank you for the bits. Well, you know, I don't have to find 18 pieces of a sea glide to get a sea glide. What the hell is this? <laughs> The scanner always used. The wait, didn't the scanner use batteries in the in the original? Easy game. Thought it did. Yeah, it does. It just does it very slowly. Uh, shelf coral. I wonder if we might need this. Yes, I am playing on hardcore mode. So if we if we die anywhere here. If we die anywhere, that's it. We have to start over. <laughs> and that means, oh no, that means we have to listen to the narration again. Okay, if I die, we might turn off the, I might turn off the voice acting. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'll think about it. What is this? Like barnacles. Huh? The stakes are sky high. <laughs> First one said that there's no story around your main character and you could be anyone. I don't mind the idea of there being like a story to this game because there has to be a reason why you have to go back to the planet. I just feel like there's just been a lot of, uh, a lot of talking and the talking is very long winded. It's like, it is, it's like five sentences on top of each other. It's like, oh my God, I'm, I'm I want to play the game. Be quiet. Uh, turb, turb, man, turd, num, na, turb named it. Turb named it. Good lord. Thank you for the two months. God. I hate your name. All right. Still looking for the sea glide here. I feel like there's got to be a piece around here. Turd Nermit. Turd Nermator. Uh, thank you again, Fletcher. Thank you for the 10 gift subs. I appreciate it. Have you missed much? We just started. Uh, let's see. Still not seeing any sea glide. I guess we got to go a little farther. First try. Listen, there's no cat. There are capital letters. Some of you guys have never heard of these basic features of the English language, like capitalization. You should really try it out sometime. It's the it's the biggest thing. It's really it's the latest rage. Uh, let's get some agua. Quiero agua. Por favor. Capitalization confirmed. Capitalism. Uh, James. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, James, thank you for 10 gift subs. Thank you very much, James. I really appreciate that, man. Thank you. There's been a lot of gift subs today. Thank you guys so much. I really appreciate it. Uh, okay. Thank you guys. Sea glide. Sea glide. Where does sea glide at? In a decent amount of resources. No sea glide. Hmm. Activates all voice entries. I haven't done anything, motherfucker. So before... Oh, there we go. I don't think I found this piece. All right. I haven't done anything. So before you fucking criticize me... That's just the game. 
Don't fucking crit it. Don't come in here with your attitude. It's subnautica time. It is subnautica time. Is this related to the first game? So I think that we are on the same planet um, as the original subnautica, but I'm assuming this has happened after the, like after the events of subnautica one, pretty much. So I'm curious to find like log entries to find out why. I think it said that Altera forbids access to this planet. It could be because, uh, perhaps that's because of the virus that they know exists. Maybe, maybe that's why they've, they've restricted. Maybe, maybe they're trying to capitalize on that. Who knows? Okay. So if we want a sea glide, we need a lubricant and a copper wire, uh, copper wire. Can you self scan? Uh, let's see. No, you cannot. And, uh, now we need a lube. Good thing I brought lube. Yeah, we cured the virus in Subnautica 1, but I mean, I, it's all, it all depends on what Altera knows and what their motives are here, right? So, right, we cured the virus, but if, if the plant, maybe they maybe they know about it and they want to weaponize it, right? Used for high speed free diving, contains a built in light and map. Okay, we got our sea glide here. Cool. Did we really cure it though? How do you know? Uh, according to the events of the first game we did <laughs> Are we the same guy? No, we're somebody totally different now new character So it looks like we can eat the mushrooms the bullseye mushrooms you can just eat those it seems like okay, cool uh, So I don't know where we're going now we have a sea glide a scanner and we've got so I feel like Never we just go explore the house without lube Ooh. You can turn on the map and you can turn on the light. Look at that. That's pretty cool. All right, neat. Uh, TKO, thanks to the 500 bits. Thank you very much. All right, well, let's... Oh, uh, how do you uh, unpin a recipe here? Unpin all. There we go. All right. How much time has passed? I don't know. We don't know. Could be a long time. Oh, now, now I'm going to find all the sea glide pieces. <laughs> okay. Two years. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, some nice quality of life improvements. I really like the lighting effects. The lighting effects are very cool. Sure, let's scan this too. Why not? Hey, 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 fuck off. Oi. No. Piece of shit. Whoa. What do we have here? Oh, let's go get some air. Okay, well, we're already hearing the exploding fish. <laughs> already hearing exploding fish. Oh, there it is. Okay, well, we got rid of them. Okay. Oof, oof. Those fish are scary. Yeah, it seems like they don't come out immediately and, and kamikaze you. It seems like, uh, yeah. Suicide. <laughs> oh, you don't get, you just get a creature egg now. What about the sulfur? You don't get the sulfur here anymore. Interesting. Sulfur plant. Okay, interesting. Oh, it's a it's a sea monkey nest. Interesting. Okay, well, we got a PDA here. Altera misplaces. Oh, is that that's the ship from the first game, right? Isn't that what that is? All right, here let's let's head back. Yeah, misplaced. Okay. I play on PS5. I am playing on PC. I'm on PC right now. I want a PC in case in the future I might want to play mods or something. Uh, all right, let's take a look at our logs here. What do we got? Is this it? Research, survival, tech. 
Uh, logs and communications. Ah, oh, here we go. Uh, Galactic News. Contact has been lost with the Aurora some 18 months ago. So the 18 months ago is when uh, the events of Subnautica 1 happened. Altera launched the Aurora to much fan for almost two years ago and recently announced the ship had arrived in the destination solar system. The Aurora has reportedly now been missed more than one routine check-in. As for common, a spokesperson said communication with ships outside the phase gate network can take weeks or months. It's commonly misinterrupted. Uh, the last time that we had no reason to think anything has changed. Nonetheless, our sources emphasize that Altera cannot yet explain the loss of contact. Uh, and they are taking every possible measure to reestablish contract. Shareholders will be watching closely. Keen readers will remember, however, that Altera's network of directors have a history of leaking scare stories like this to the press, only for the transgov to rebound with positive news against the odds. Directors' shareholdings and dealings are, of course, not public information. So that's some kind of, like, cover-up about the events of Subnautica 1. They're just, like, not revealing anything. Well, we found a creature egg. Uh, Robin, thanks for 27 months. Thank you very much for 26 months. Okay, let's keep uh, let's keep exploring here. I don't have a com oh, I, how, what do I hang on? What do I need for a compass? Compass would be pretty. A compass would be very helpful because I have no idea where I'm going. <laughs> uh, copper wire. Oh, we need two silvers, I think, for for a compass. Yeah, we need a wiring kit. I think wiring kits are normally two silver. Yeah, yeah. I, I always I'm thinking about Wayland Yutani too. Yeah, exactly. Uh, poop computer. Thank you for the 21 months. Thank you, poop computer. Ah. If you ever unsubscribe, I'll shove a lightning bolt up your ass. Keep on looking. Ooh, what is that? Uh, supply cache nearby. Altera supply cache. Hmm. Owl rounder. Thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. The fuck is this? Titan whole fish. We call this the sex fish. <laughs> you can breathe in the hole. You can breathe in the hole. Ow! Ooh! Ow! Owie! What happened? <laughs> okay. Don't stick your dick in that. Do not stick. Oh my god! <laughs> Not a good idea. Take it from me, guys. Don't stick your dick in that one. The dangerous one. The pleasures of the flesh. <laughs> a whole lot of this. Ah, uh, thumbtack. Thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. It did say that there was an Altera supply cache nearby. Hmm. Not seeing nothing. Would it be on the surface, maybe? Alright, some somehow we made it to fucking Iceland. Oh, emer oh, here we go. Emergency supply cache. There we go. I didn't see that. I am playing on hardcore. Yes, I am playing on hardcore. How's our inventory? Okay, we got plenty of room. Okay. I like grabbing the salt. It'll be nice for... Uh... Oh, that was that the Northern Lights? Aurora Borealis! It was. Okay. Let's head on over here. This time of year... Yes. May I see it? No. <laughs> okay, here we go. Here we go. Mineral detector. I don't know what that is. Cool. Uh, a first aid kit. Thank you so much. Extremely helpful. New blueprint synthesized. Get another PDA. Oh, is that fucking, uh, what's that guy's name? It's the guy from Parks and Rec. One of the best things. Portable scanning room? Oh, I don't know. I, 
Aurora Borealis. At this time of year, at this part of the planet, localized entirely in your kitchen. It's Ron Swanson. <laughs> you know, Seymour, you're an odd fellow. You steam a good ham. <laughs> Seymour, the house is on fire! No, mother, it's just the Northern Lights. Uh, what do we got here? Stick, light stick. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I like you. I don't know if I like that thing. Okay, let's, uh... Head back. I want to see what that mineral fragment thing is going to be. Maybe that lets you quickly scan for stuff or something. Maybe. Let's find out. It's an Albany expression. <laughs> Steamed hams. It's a one man show. Conan didn't write that. He was long gone. That was Bill Oakley and Josh Weinstein. We haven't seen anything horrifying yet. Nothing horrifying yet. We did stick our dick in a fish. Uh, that one was pretty scary. But everything turned out okay. Okay, let's see. Uh, we wanted to make... I don't have any silver yet. I still haven't found crystalline sulfur. Primary detector used to locate materials. Oh, okay, cool. So we can make this mineral detector. This is new. This is a totally new thing. So let's take, uh, we're gonna make a copper wire. Hmm. Like a clam on a fish. <laughs> and uh, let's see, where is the tool? And we need one rubber. I think I have, don't I have rubber in the storage locker? I sure do, I sure do. Come prepared. Always be prepared. My Boy Scouts, my brief stint in the Boy Scouts has taught me for this. The mineral detector can sniff out raw materials, potentially saving you hundreds of hours of searching. Okay. Well, whatever it is, I just know that Orator will call it bullshit. Mineral detector? Bullshit. Need to eat? Bullshit. Have to breathe? Bullshit. <laughs> All bullshit. Have to drink? Bullshit. Why the robot gotta be Soviet? <laughs> Soviet. Uh, all right, let's. We can cure some food. First, let's make a bunch of water. Thermometer, bullshit. <laughs> Playing the game, bullshit. Exactly. Make some pipes. Uh, all right, let's cure some food here, so we don't have to run back all the time. That's why salt is nice. Salt is underrated. Drinky, drinky, and cookie, cookie. Okay, I don't, can I fucking throw the creature eggs? Are almost always useless. Oh, okay, all right. Let's go see what this thing does. This is our. Oh, select next gold. Oh, check it out. We can like search. Wow, we can search. So how do you search? So I want to I want to look for crystalline sulfur. Let's find that. This is so cool. Look at this. This is neat. Oh, I like it. It sucks. It doesn't work. <laughs> this thing fucking sucks. Well, it's telling me about quartz. I don't really need quartz. I wonder how close you have to be. This is how close I have to be? <laughs> All right, we well, still need to find so calaverite outcrop. Hmm. All right, so obviously it has its limitations. It can't just tell you where everything is. All right, so it has its limitations. Fair enough. Out of power. All right, we're still looking for silver. 
don't really know how much quartz I need. Ooh, that is a big hunk of something. Just like ice. That's a chance of copper. What does it say? A chance of copper, titanium. Okay, interesting. Big hunk of burning love. Uh, so we found one piece of a mobile vehicle bay. We're going to have to look around for that, too. Oh, who turned on the lights? <laughs> Somebody turned on the light switch there. Okay, I want to go down this cave. Hang on. Cloudy with a chance of copper. Let's see, what do we got? There we go. So we're looking for this thing. It's, uh... Argentine? Yeah, there we go. That's what we're looking for. Pull back! <laughs> okay. Maybe we can find some crystal sulfur down there, too. Uh, maybe we should make a giant pipe that goes all the way down here. What do you guys think? Whoa, what? Okay, that looks like a fucking Venus flytrap. Look at this fucking thing. Oxygen plant? This looks like fucking kill you plant. What this looks like. Okay, cool. Interesting. There are a lot of these fucking asshole crash fish, aren't there? There's a lot of these guys. It's like something made a nest over here. Okay. Copper is always good. There's a lot of these assholes. Oh, sulfur? Ooh, yeah. All right. Let's can we scan it. Then let's pick it up. Nice. Got some sulfur. Uh, I'm not seeing any more oxygen fish. Oh, hey. Oxygen, bitch. There we go. Oh, that barely filled my oxygen. All right, whatever. Have I taken damage yet? Yeah, I, I stuck my dick in a hole fish, and it, it hurt, apparently. <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck? What the fuck is this thing? What we got here? Mineral. Oh, we already have that, right? Yeah, already got that. Oh, we found guys. We're already finding the cosmetic shit. Hell yeah. Needed that. Is that it? Oh, I, I was expecting there to be something more here. Pengling. Can I eat them? They look delicious. Like deep fried battered penguins. Is this like a shark cage? That does not fill me with confidence. Is this like a fucking shark cage here? It looks like some more shit sunk to the bottom. I like a fucking shark cage. Does not fill me with confidence. Oh, beacons. Beacons are nice. Some agua there. Uh, Miho's Magic. Thank you for the gifts. Five gift subs. Thank you very much. Thank you, Miho's Magic. What is this? Table Coral. Knife, please. All right. I definitely heard something loud. Hmm. 
Definitely hearing something. Uh, Panda Handstands. Thank you for the uh, 17 months. Thank you very much. Oh. Gonna keep looking for this uh, Argentine. Argentite. Excuse me. Argentite. Keep looking for that. There we go. We already have the sea glide. Uh, inventory. Okay, well, inventory's full. Let's go head back. All right. You need one more for the sea glide. Nope, we found all that. We already had the sea glide. Already got it. The game Samus you and make you forget everything from the first game. Uh, we're a different person on this one. We didn't crash land on this planet. It seems like we snuck onto this planet uh, against Altera's wishes. And I think we're trying to find, is it our sister? Is that what it was? We might be looking for our sister. No, no, no. So we don't know what happened with our sister right now. Let's go and make some glass. Let's make some inventory space. Yeah, the hand scanner is pretty nice. It's pretty nice for sure. Did you find Helios? Think she's dead? Uh, possibly, we don't know. Okay, so we were, uh, we found sulfur so we can actually make the repair tool. Uh, we should probably do that. Oh, uh, I don't know why we would want that at all. Flashlight might be okay, too. We haven't even seen anywhere that's super dark yet, so I'm not too worried about that. Oh, it looks like we can already make beacons. Let's make a beacon. Beacons are good. Use beacons to mark traverse territory. Show or hide the signals of your choice with your Make some bacon. Sorry, sounds different from early access. Yeah, I don't know anything about early access. I didn't play it, so. Okay, let's make a copper wire. And we're going to make uh, this kit, this wiring kit, so we can make our compass. There we go. Compass is going to be very useful so we have any idea where we're going. <laughs> going to need that compass. All right, compass installed. Uh, ooh, you can distract. Check it out. You can distract certain predators with the flare. Is that like Jurassic Park? Like, <laughs> I think it might be. Okay, the T Rex. Yeah, right. Maybe we should keep one of those on hand. I've got a ton of titanium now. Uh, oh, I needed a... Didn't I need a rubber for the repair tool? I think I did. Our dino DNA. All right, let's make a repair tool. You could do that in the original Subnautica. You can, like, throw a flare to distract. I, I never... If that's the case, I never knew that. <laughs> I did not know that. All right, the creature egg is useless. Let's throw that out. Drop. Okay. Update the pin recipe. Yeah, we're going to unpin that. Unpin all. Uh, all right, so what are we looking for now? Hmm. The ability to pin the recipes is very nice. We're obviously looking for a mobile vehicle bay, so I guess that's our biggest priority right now is the mobile vehicle. Well, the eating I don't I don't know if I like the eating noises. <laughs> Hey, let's turn on the uh, map here. Turn this on. Nope. All right, so we're gonna head. All right, let, let, let's think about this. Right. We already. Do we already go to the supply cache? I think we already went there. And we're here. Okay. Can you pin multiple things? Uh, I'm not sure. Can you? Let's try it out. Big gulps, huh? Oh, you can, yeah, you can pin as many things as you want. Check it out. <laughs> That's awesome. That's really awesome. You can unpin everything. All right. Let's start a bet. It's 45 minutes so far. Let's start prediction. Uh, will Barb die in the next hour? Uh, well, let's go two hours. Will I die in the next two hours? Yes or no? I'll let you guys... Place your bet. So at 2.45, it's going to be a longer bet. You guys place your bets. There you go. 
Easy now. Will I die in the next two hours? You guys make your choices there. Uh, is hardcore permadeath? Yes. If I die, it's game over. Possibly a terrible idea. <laughs> Possibly a terrible idea. Stick around. I've got plenty of I've got plenty of terrible ideas. All right, let's head north from our life pod here. Let's uh, turn off the map. The map isn't really helping. All it takes is one Leviathan. Oh, we found, is this a big hole fish? Thank you, whole fish. Quick, stick my dick in there. What is this? Oh, it's a creature egg, huh? All right. Uh, more salt, quartz. So I guess we're looking for the mobile vehicle bay now. What we're looking for? What the fuck is that? These things are shooting goddamn laser beams. You see that? Oh, uh, this game is standalone. You don't have to have the original Subnautica. Ooh. Ooh. What we got there? Hey, only one more for the mo- Oh, I got it! <laughs> Fuck you. They're gonna fucking steal my sea glide or something, man. All right, so we only need one more piece for the mobile vehicle bay. I'm really curious what's on the surface. I'm really, I really want to get to the surface and walk around there. I feel like that actually scares me the most. Like I'm less scared of the water than I am of the surface. <laughs> there's gotta be like a fucking like, there's gotta be like a polar bear, right? Like some kind of polar bear equivalent. Uh, old King Call. Thank you for the uh, 15 months. Thank you very much. Uh, lights. That's Morse. Right? That sounds like a distress call. Origin. Source of transmission depth calculated at approximately 200 meters. Hmm. Interesting. So it seems like I'm not alone on the planet. There's definitely other uh, other people here. Interesting. Interesting. Kind of SOS. I wonder if there... Is there going to be other people in this game? Am I going to see other characters at some point? Oh, well, this is uh, interesting. Like a new wow! This is so cool. Look, it looks like a fucking Christmas lights show. I'd like to find the mobile vehicle bay. I'd like to find that. So pretty. I sure hope not. Did I crash land? Uh, no, we didn't crash land. We intentionally came to this planet. We had to like sneak onto it. Uh, I'm seeing sparking over there. What is that? Should go check that out. Uh, this is another sea glide. Okay. Okay. Let's head over here and let's see what we got. Engineer should fly Delta next time. This might be. Were we here before? This is the shark cage. Uh, I think we were here before. Yeah. Yeah, and this is all the stuff we found down here. All right, every, everything is open, and we saw everything here. Okay. Uh, Ferrarist, thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. Have I died yet? I have not died yet. This would be kind of cool if I win. If I win hardcore mode on my first playthrough, that'd be kind of cool. I don't know if that's likely. But I think it'd be kind of cool. 
We're still, we only need one piece for the mobile vehicle pay. Uh, can I, can I search for it actually? Salt, able coral, galena. It looks like I can't search for it. Okay. Oh, wait, fragment? It's gotta be a fragment, right? Let's see. Okay, well, it's gonna, whoa, oh, okay. I thought that was something else. We don't need that fragment. Right. Usually at least 10 hours so we can watch you. I don't think we're likely to beat this in like one sitting. I think this I think this is gonna take a little while to get through this game. <laughs> see, any fragments? Any fragments? Oh, got a fragment. Fragment coming up. Oh, we passed it. Oh, I must be right on top of it then, right? Okay, let's go get some air and let's go see what we can find. Do I have more batteries? Uh, I do, yeah. We'll be all right. The fuck? What's this thing? Scan. Radiant Sieve Coral. Everything scares you. Kelp Root, sure. Let's go scan that too, why not? It says there's a fragment nearby. I'm not seeing shit though. Hmm? What was that scream? Grand Pearl 3 is now delayed. Oh, fuck off. Hey Barb, I know you're really excited about this game, but I want to remind you about this free ROM hack? Oh, here it is. I want to remind you. Oh, it's just a grab trap. I know you're having fun, but it, it'd be nice if you could get that done. <sighs> oh, this looks uh interesting. Oh, whole fish. Stick your dick in it. There we go. What are these? Oh, I thought, is it hurting me? Frost anemone. Okay, let's scan that too. Why not? Uh, more sea glide. Hmm. Any scanner? Yeah, I don't like that. I feel like those laser beam guys are going to fucking merc me. I don't like that. I don't trust that. Okay. Any scanners? Yeah, we're looking for a last fragment here. I'm not seeing anything yet. Hmm, not seeing nothing. That fish just shit in front of me. That's the beauty of nature, man. Natural world just shits right on top of your head. Uh, no fragments nearby, it seems. Occasionally in Subnautica 1, you would see an, a, a fish would just like fly out like a fucking rocket had hit it. <laughs> I wonder, I feel like that's not going to happen in this game. <laughs> but that's not going to happen this time around. I'm trying to keep track of where there's oxygen above me because I don't want to get trapped beneath the ice. I don't want to get trapped like that. Mm, no fragments. There's an oxygen there. Okay. We're really not too far from our thing here. Never seen a laser beam fish. Oh. Fragment. What do we got? Oh, hey, check it out. Mobile vehicle bay. Fuck yeah. Hey, get out of here. Uh, Elgo Stell, thank you for the Twitch Prime. Thank you very much. All right, let's head back to base. Let's see what we need to build the mobile vehicle bay. We may have the stuff. Come on, get it. 
Get out of here. The hell y'all doing? Those damn sea monkeys. Uh, Boshek, thank you for the nine months. Badger, thank you for the 12 months. Thank you very much. Okay, let's see. What do we need for the mobile vehicle? We need a titanium ingot, a computer chip, and uh, a lubricant. All right, let's go get this titanium. I've got plenty of titanium. Go grab all this titanium here. Yeah, you can pin the recipes. Yeah, so okay, hang on. Let me let me get, try to get used to that. I, I'm not I'm not used to doing it yet. So mobile vehicle bay. Uh, this is pin. Okay, there we go. I'm not used to doing that yet. That wasn't in Subnautica one. Uh, Badger farmer Boshek, thank you for the resubs, guys. Thank you very much. Okay, lube. And we need a computer chip. We need two table coral, gold, and a copper wire. I don't think we have any gold yet. I don't think we do. So we're gonna have to find some gold. We can get the copper wire. And uh, let's see, computer chip, we can pin that too. Uh, pin, there we go, cool. So we only have one table coral. We need to find some more of that. Pin the chip. Right, I just pinned it, assholes. Jesus Christ, calm down. Relax, I'm playing. God, Jesus Christ, you guys. Uh, Cynical Breeze, thank you for the tier three 11 months. Thank you very much. My wife just told me I think you love that guy more than you love me. <laughs> uh, thank you very much. All right, so we need one more table coral and one gold. We can manage that. Uh, I have no agua. I should also, I think my battery is about dead on this. Yeah, so we're gonna need to get another battery. Quiero agua, por favor. Por favor. Mm. Need a new, yeah, we have, I think I made a couple of extra batteries. We should be good. Water. Everyone using book, even when he just used it. Uno más agua. That's Portuguese. <laughs> uh, I thought I made a battery. Maybe I didn't. I can't remember what I need for batteries. <laughs> what do I need for batteries? Put it! Put it! Oh, I just need one more plant. Okay. One more plant. Those would be... That would be a convenient plant to uh, have. That'd be a convenient plant to have uh, if we were if we were found a grow bed or something. Could you not drink like a psycho? Our character drinks like uh, <laughs> like like fucking Hannibal Lecter, getting some uh, fava beans and a nice Chianti. <laughs> I eat his liver. Robin's probably British. Okay, so we're looking for some uh, coral. I think we were here already. You looked away and you were like, what's that sound? I wonder, can I scan? I don't think I can scan for coral, can I? Uh, next. Oh, there we go. Table coral. Moving to the country, gonna need some table coral. That song was your dog. That was your dog drinking. Nope. Pass some. Peaches come from a can. So table coral is nowhere near as prevalent as it was in Subnautica One. It seems. <laughs> All right. So now we need a gold. Sing it, brother. They were put there by a man in a factory downtown. Uh, Dendi, thank you for the 16 months. Thank you, Dendi. 
All right, so can I search for... I don't think I can search for gold, though, right? I don't think that works, because gold is inside of something else. Oh, I probably should grab that for water. Yeah. Definitely hearing some loud noises. Unique identifier. Delta Station Dock. Delta Station. This is the place Lil mentioned in her message. Hmm. Interesting. Ooh. Big outcropping. Yeah, I don't think this can have gold. I don't think we can search for gold like that. Let's... Limestone, copper, fragments... I don't know if we want to search for Galena. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm not sure what we want to search for here. In Subnautica one it was sandstone. I don't know what I'm looking for here. Okay. Okay, so we've got this one. Is this uh, emergency supply cache? It said something about, oh yeah, Delta Station. We could go out there. Um, all we need is one gold, though. I feel like we should get that first. Copper. All right, let's go over there. Let's head over this way to Delta Station. Maybe we'll find something on the way. This is, uh, wow, pretty deep. I wonder how deep you go in this game. I am curious. Oh, I'm seeing something. Warning, passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Uh, you know... There's something over here. Yeah, it seems like that's the alien tech from Subnautica 1. What is this shit? Oh, hang on. Oh, rebreather. Cool. Neato. Oh, that's a big fucking fish. That does not look like a friendly fish. Okay, get up. Up. Does not look friendly. I'm glad we found the blueprint for the rebreather, though. That seems like that's going to be something that's going to be really important. Okay. All right, let's keep heading towards Delta Station. Ooh, what do we have here? Sea truck? The fuck is the sea truck? <laughs> the sea truck? Hell yeah, brother! <laughs> oh, we got like volcanoes and shit here. Okay. More sea truck. We got a long way to go. In a short time to get there. Um, eastbound, just rock on bandit run. I think it's Argentine is the thing we need for gold. That's what we need. Old Smokey's got his ears on. <laughs> oh, there it is. There it is. We got it. Okay, beacon. I go, oh, that's just a straight up beacon you can just pick up. My, Mr. Coffee! We found Mr. Coffee. <laughs> it's a good thing we found Mr. Coffee. I'm gonna need this. Mm. Ew, God.
We're saved. Everybody knows I have coffee while I have radar. Everybody knows that. Like a generator. This is a recorded message. If you can hear this, you're trespassing. If you know it's good for you, you'll get the hell out of here. Uh oh, we're getting cold. There must be some kind of suit or something. Okay, so we just got cold. Should we leave that beacon here? All right, we're going to, let's go drop that beacon off. I wanted to take that beacon, but let's drop it. And uh, let's edit it. That woman sounded a mite unfriendly. Let's call this old, this is Delta Station Doc. We're gonna name this Arkansas. This is old Arkansas here. That woman sounded a mite unfriendly. We don't take kindly to your tap around here. Okay, so we can make the mobile vehicle bay. I think we only needed one more thing for the... Uh, I think I only needed one more thing for the sea truck. Let's look around and see... Oh, never mind. There it is. <laughs> never mind. Okay. Cool. So, new blueprint synthesized. Sea truck. All right, let's head back to uh, our life pod. Technology acquired. I guess they really wanted you to have, yeah, they really wanted you to have the sea truck pretty fa pretty fast, huh? Okay, cool. I call this a productive trip. Uh, how do I, can I put some truck nuts on my sea truck? <laughs> the truck nuts, so if, if, you, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, uh, the truck nuts are a peripheral that you hang on the back of your truck on the bottom and it looks like a giant pair of swinging testicles. <laughs> and you put that on your car so it looks like your truck has testicles. And yes, people do use them. I lived in Florida. And uh, people do use those and put those on the back of their car. <laughs> they definitely do. <laughs> Terrible. I don't know if they're I don't know if they're quite in style anymore. Perhaps the truck nuts are no longer in vogue, so to speak. They're learning so much. It's it's a little piece of American culture for y'all. It's up here in Illinois too. <laughs> Alright, so we have to go make our computer chip. Oh. States banned them. All right, so we can also make a sea truck depth module. Enameled glass. So you needed the sawtooth, uh, the dolphin thing for the, to make the enameled glass. I don't know how you make enameled glass in this one. Let's make our mobile vehicle bay. First resident evil. Now this, <laughs> two bar B ha games in a row. Hell yeah, brother. Uh, Sour Newt, thank you for the 500 bits. Thank you very much. Okay, my inventory is full. Let's go. Um, to drop off some shit here. Let's go put this glass and the salt away. Put that silver away. Okay. Done. Not good. What the hell's going on out here? Whoa. Can I be struck by lightning? <laughs> Whoa. I sure hope I can't be uh, struck by lightning. No, 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 don't drop it. You got to deploy it. Stop dropping it. Okay. Launch the mobile vehicle bay. All right, what do we need to make our sea truck? We need a titanium ingot, advanced wiring kit, two glass, three lead, and a power cell. I think we can manage that. Pin it. All right, let's, you guys, you guys in your pins. <laughs> Why is Barb talking like me? I, I ain't understand. 
Okay, where is this vehicle? Okay, pin recipe. There we go. I understand why you talk like me, Barber's King. Okay, got our glass. We needed three lead. Got our lead. Make a titanium ingot. I don't know how we're going to make the advanced wiring kit, though. It's probably a wiring kit. Is it? It's a wiring kit and then something else. And a computer chip. Okay. So we're going to need... We're definitely going to need more... Um, uh, we're definitely going to need another need computer chip. We're going to need more gold, copper, and... Wow, that's a lot. That's a lot. Uh, Drubik's Cube. Thank you for the 17 months. Thank you, Drubik's Cube. All right. So we have that. So now we need uh, two copper... Uh, for for a copper wire, gold, and another table coral. I think I only found the one gold. All right, let's go put away all this stuff. We don't need that anymore. We don't need the rubber either. All right. I mean, I don't want to have too many pins. Uh, unknown availability. Thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. All right, we need to find some copper. Uh, there we go. Nope. Ah, uh, whatever. Let's have a flare just in case. How do you throw a flare anyway? Alright. Pin it up, smelt it. Have you played enough uh, to compare to the base game yet? Well, it definitely feels a lot like Subnautica. Um, I don't know if it quite has the same opening as Subnautica because the, the beginning of Subnautica kind of has like this urgency to it because trying to survive the aurora just crashed this one feels a little bit more relaxed i guess you could say you're like a slightly more relaxed all right so we're still looking for uh table coral oh copper would also be nice actually a little bit more relaxed this time of year there is the we have seen aurora borealis we already, already made those jokes. <laughs> yeah, we needed copper, so that's good. You're going to start Subnautica for the first time? I think Subnautica is like the best of this genre. Uh, silver is good. Uh, we need copper. Also need gold. Oh, I should have seen what the uh, rebreather required. I didn't look at that. That would have been smart. Warning. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency. Yeah, that increased. would have been smart. We already have the sea truck. We already got that sea truck. We're fine. We ain't need light. Oh, is this. Oh, wow. We we're looking for this, right? Hang on. I think we need one more table coral. Let the computer's voice reverse bends. Uh, I'm having a lot of fun so far standing in. I'm really curious to uh, explore the world more. There was more. Well, I am. I, I'm trying to be safe with this thing called oxygen because I kind of have to do this thing called breathing. Kind of important. Oh, got some table coral. There we go. Table Coral and Subnautica 1 was just like everywhere. Like you couldn't miss it. <laughs> There's no way you can miss Table Coral and Subnautica 1. The game just buckets it on your head. Breathing is overrated. Breathing? You plebs still breathe? Uh, okay, so we still need another gold. Okay, gold. There was gold over by Arkansas. Let's let's head let's head quickly back to Arkansas. See if we can find some gold over there. There's gold in them there hills. You like how the coral bridge looks like tentacles? Okay, there are more dangerous. You can see that there's some more dangerous. Maybe that's what's making the roaring noise. <laughs> Not seeing anything too large. 
don't know what that was. Yeah, there was gold over here by this, like, uh, this, these thermal vents. Hmm? Looking for gold. Uh, we'll take silver. Copper, silver, and gold. You're late. Uh, I don't really need titanium. I need gold. Oh, hey, lithium. I think that's our first piece of, li piece of lithium we found. Our first piece of lithium. Mineral rich crevices detected below. Geothermal activity detected. Caution advised. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I need gold. Hmm. Right. Uh, any deaths yet? No deaths. We are playing on hardcore mode. So if I die, the jig is up. It's probably a stupid idea. It was probably dumb to play on hardcore mode, but here we are. Oh, we're going to have, I feel like the game in, in Subnautica 1, silver was kind of rare. In this game, I feel like I'm getting insane amounts of silver already. An hour 30 left. I think we started the bet at, at 45 minutes. Yeah, I really just need one more piece of gold here. I'll feel a lot better when we're not exposed and we can get the sea truck. I will feel a lot better about our survivability. And just find that sea truck. I'm getting so much gold. Holy crap. Pick gold out of the orange rock. I'm just kind of looking for anything. What's my... I still have plenty of room in my inventory. I need... I need... What is it? Do I need two gold or one gold? I can't remember. If only there was some kind of function that lets you do that. Did you see what you needed? Ah! Okay, gold. I think I need, I think I need another. Okay, I don't know what that was, but it sounded like something right behind me. <laughs> I don't know what that was. It sounded like there was something right behind me. Oh, it's like a mountain up there. You see that? Hmm, interesting. It sounded like there was something right fucking behind me about to kill me. I don't know what that was. Aww. Aww. Well, that's not good. All right. Any calaverite? Any calaverite? Uh oh. Check W. Up. Oh. Signal. Can I get my ass blasted from here or are we good? It must be way below me. 
All right, let's uh, we're gonna unload the battery from this And we're gonna put this battery in here. Oh, did I miss it? Oh, there it is. Yeah, I missed it. All right gold Fucking god damn it I should probably make some more batteries I think More batteries seems like a good decision. If the work in 20, you're excited to watch the VOD later? Oh, I'm glad. I hope you enjoy watching. I'm having a lot of fun playing. Do need one more piece of gold though. C truck. We already got our C truck. Thank you. Uh, more lithium. I guess we'll grab some more lithium too. We just, I think we just need one more gold. Come on, man. I want my C. I want my C truck. Oh, don't we have to make a power cell too? I don't know how to, I don't even know how we make a power cell. I guess we'll figure that out. Uh, let us drinky drinky and eat a snacky. Oh, gold, gold, any golders? I don't like these sounds. I don't like these sounds, man. <laughs> uh, by the way, if you guys didn't see, there is a new tier one emote. Uh, I added it for Subnautica, it's Barb S. And there is a tier two emote, which is Barb S2, which is just very slightly different. So if you guys haven't seen, uh, new emotes just for the occasion. There you go. All right, let's head back. We now we we can make the advanced wiring kit. I think we can. I don't know how to make the power cell yet. We'll take a look. Well, I'm poor. Pin it up. I think uh, I don't remember how many channel points that I set to unlocking an emote. How many channel points did I set that to? I did that forever ago. Uh, Bray Flox, thank you for the 29 months. Thank you, Bray Flox. Real M. Conal, thank you for the four months. Danger Tater. Thank you for 40 months. Uh, Mickey Mayhem. Thank you for the resub. Thank you, guys. Holy crap. 1,500. Ah, that's not a lot of channel points. Pretty cheap. Uh, Barbasaurus Rex. Thank you for the 16 months. Yeah, thank you very much. Anonymous. Thank you for the gift sub. Thank you very much. Tier 1 subs can unlock tier 2 emotes. All right, uh, let's see. So we're making our copper wire for the advanced wiring kit, I think. We need to make a computer chip, make that. Imagine being a peasant. Let's make our advanced wiring kit, okay. So I think all we need now is the power cell. That's all we need. Let's make some more wiring kits while we're here. And what do we need for a power cell? Two, oh, that's easy. Two batteries and a silicone rubber. I think I have, I actually have two dead batteries. So that's perfect. You know what time it is, guys. I'm gonna get our C truck. <laughs> Let's see, one second, hang on. It's, I think it's trucking time, y'all. I think it might be trucking time. See. All right, let's go get it. Right. I gotta turn this music off because I don't want the VOD to get muted. All right, I don't want the VOD getting muted. People are gonna watch. <laughs> All right, C truck. Here we got. We're trucking. The hell is that thing? <laughs> All right, how do you get into it? Oh, from the top. Okay. Ooh. Oh, dude, look at how the look at how your character moves their hands for the joystick. Oh, that's so cool. 
Alrighty, interesting, interesting. Okay. Let's uh, unpin that. There we go. All right about then, them Duke boys showed up. <laughs> That's how you get out. Is there something? Oh, when you get out, you're like right on top of it. That's pretty cool. You look at there's an upgrade panel. Okay, yeah, I wanted to see if there was anything else. Okay, there was something for the upgrades here too. Let's see. I don't know, maybe, oh, you know what? The upgrades are in the thing downstairs, I think. Hmm? Isn't a real sea truck until you get a big garage to park it in, brother? Hey, hell yeah, man. I'm right there with you. Okay. Let's go ahead and get out. I feel like you got out of your vehicle faster in, in Subnautica 1. All right, so if we want that, we need a plasteel ingot and two enamel glass. Uh, we can make that pretty. We can actually make that right now. Let's go ahead and do that now. Uh, Prism Ranger, thank you for the gift sub to Darth Roni. Thank you very much. Okay, we already made the plasteel ingot. What do we need for enamel glass? Oh, wow, so this is different. So now if you want to make enamel glass, it's not a stalker tooth. Now it's a diamond. Oh, we can try to look for a diamond to get that. Uh, that's what we need for the upgrade now. All right, what about the uh, rebreather? Oh, well, this is really easy. We just need a fiber mesh and a silicone rubber. Okay, that's pretty easy. I think I maybe have... Oh, I actually have both. Got it both. Rebreather. Is your sea truck garage be too small? Extensive free diving. Is it Body gonna be too small? I have to park it at an angle. Efficiently at significant depths. All right, so I feel like we're in pretty good shape to try to get. Uh, let's see, do I want to? All right, let's pin this. Where's enamel glass? Well, we already we just know it needs diamond, right? We know that. Oh, look, nickel and kyanite too? Fuck, man. <laughs> Damn. I don't know where we're going to get that. Thermos, insulated storage receptacle for beverages. Interesting. Let's, we can make a thermos. Let's make a thermos. Why not? I'm going to have to get more, but. What does this do? Thermos. Thermos? What do you guys say? Thermos or thermos? Okay, what does this do? <laughs> what does this do? Can I store, like, water or something? I don't get it. Ther thermos. My thermos to the buffet? Thermos? Coffee? Oh, maybe I can put coffee in my, ther in my thermos? <laughs> Why, you guys? You guys just always want to criticize... The way I say everything. You ever thought that maybe you're the one that says it wrong? You ever think you guys are the one that says it wrong, huh? Maybe. Nope. Keep stuff hot. All right. I have to, it's been about an hour 30. I have to get up and pee because I had too much coffee in my thermos this morning. We're going to save and quit just so I don't die or get dehydration or something. Fuck. Did my audio just change for you guys? Oh, there we go. It did? Is my audio like... Okay, are we back to normal now? Weird. Okay, I don't know what happened. Okay, I'm gonna get up. Yeah, good now. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. Alright, uh, I'll be back in uh, just one second, guys. Be right back. Uh, hang on. I can pause the timer one second. How do I pause? We'll set pause to be back. Okay. All right. I will be back in uh, just one sec, guys. Be right back. Two seconds. Just really got to pee. Sorry, guys. Be right back.
All right. Sorry about that. Uh, I am back. I just really had to pee. One second here. How much fun was it watching Beast play that fucking WWF game yesterday? That was so much fun. Uh, let's see. Is it pause start? Can I just do that? Is there a way it does resume? Okay, that resumes it. Okay. Resume the timer. That was so cool. I know. That's so good. I'm je Honestly, I'm kind of jealous of Beast because that's like such a cool idea to beat every game on the Nintendo 64. I kind of want to do something like that someday. I don't know. I don't know when I'll ever do something like that, but someday I'd like to do something like that. Great idea. Yeah, I'm, I'm, je I'm jealous. That was a good idea. Okay, it's an enormous undertaking. It really is. It really is. All right, let's get back in there. Hour 32 so far. Well, let's do it. One of them do the SNES. We, I, I was asking about that one day. How many games are even on the SNES and shit? Oh, he's already done Superman 64. He got it really fast. Okay, so let's see. Let's, uh, oh, we have a thermo, the thermos, thermos. <laughs> oh, damn it. Uh, let's get some, uh, I wonder if you could store multiple drinks of water in it. Do you think maybe that's what you can do? That'd be pretty cool if you could do that. 718 SNES games. God damn. There's a lot of SNES games. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe someday. We were, we just got the rebreather already. Okay. So can I like... How do you use this? Does it have to be coffee? Anyway, I can, can I, I can't make, you know what? I can't make the coffee thing. I can't make that until I can make the, uh, what is it? The base fabricator or whatever. Yeah. I don't think I can make that yet. Isn't it a Yeti? Yeah. I can't use it yet. I don't think. Okay, so we need enamel glass. We need two enamel glass. Um, maybe we should pin enamel glass right now because we need diamond. So we need uh, two of these. We also need quartz. Also need that. All right, let's pin that one. Yeah, we need the habitat builder for sure. Okay. We're going to keep an eye out for quartz. Uh, Quartz, and we need to try to find diamond. I haven't found any diamond yet. We can go pretty deep now. I guess 150 is our maximum depth, so not that deep, but. I'm gonna look around for diamond. Let's go grab this uh, quartz. probably be faster if we just kept using the sea glide honestly <laughs> but how are you gonna not use your sea truck i know barb stream early you missed a ton uh, i stream at 8 a.m uh every weekday on the weekends i stream uh a bit later oh I got some more. We need quartz for the glass because I use glass for my thermos. So, thermos, thermos. You know, I I'll say something and then chat's like, "No, you're wrong." And then then I start questioning. Wait, is that how do I say it again? <laughs> then I don't know how to say it. Yeah, Germans actually hate me, except that I am punctual. That's the only thing they like about me. Oh, we were here before, remember? Yeah, this is where we found the uh, the mask, right? Okay, I don't like that thing. That thing looks dangerous. Oh, mate, enjoy the game. What's happened so far? Peepo arrived. I haven't seen any diamond yet. Let's keep going this way, maybe. Ah, uh, strife for life. Thank you for the bits. It looks like there's some shit down there. All right, let's park our sea truck right up here. If you ever unsubscribe, I'll shove a lightning bolt up your ass. And let's head on down. Nothing looks like uh, an... Huh. 
kind of uh, alien base. A lot of quartz. Not seeing any diamond. Maybe I can search for diamond. Hmm. I'm not German and I do hate you. <laughs> diamond. Up. Oh. You can you tell me where diamond is? Diamond. Okay. Let's go replenish our oxygen real quick. for diamond not seeing any diamond here same we're watching for the shot in front hmm maybe I'm in the wrong area for diamond maybe it's not here I feel like the game wants me to keep going down here because they put all these oxygen plants. Oh. Diamond. my first vaccine shot so close thanks for the streams during this effed up year all right we got a gel sack oh, there's a lot there's a lot of gel sacks here well i'm not sure what these are going to be for but let's grab them yet i wanted to scan this thing sea truck storage module I am going to die. Is there oxygen around here? There's a diamond down there somewhere. I just don't know where. Hmm. I don't know where this diamond is. Uh oh, I got turned around. Okay. Oof. Scary. All right. Get the set, get the safety. It might be these things that are roaring. Oh, uh, I hope you're friendly. <laughs> I sure hope you're friendly. So we know there's a diamond down here. We know there's diamond down here somewhere. It's kind of dangerous to dive down here, though. Hmm. Watched the abyss last night. Some other scanning thing we can go and grab this while we're here yep the storage module i need one more for that i guess we saw a diamond here we know up oh. it might be really far down might be the problem
Oh, there we go. Got two diamonds. That's for the two enameled glass. Okay. And this is all we needed for this. Okay. Oh, what is that? Fucking squid. Okay, we see something unfriendly down here. It looks unfriendly. I keep getting my fucking sea truck confused. I keep getting it confused. That's the sea truck. All right. Yeah, we found our two diamonds, so that's pretty nice. You didn't see, you didn't see the squid? There was some kind of squid monster in there. I don't, I don't know what that thing is going to be, obviously. Um, we got two diamond that we need for enamel glass. We have all the quartz. We just need to go make the glass now. All right, let's go ahead and do that. If we can get our sea truck down there, it would help us out so much because then we could have a place to get oxygen from. Uh, so let's go ahead back. Yeah, this game is gorgeous. It's definitely like a step up from Subnautica. Like Subnautica is a beautiful game, but uh, this game does... Like the fish animations, the lighting, uh, this game, this game looks very, very good. <laughs> I have watched River Monsters. Yeah, River Monsters is pretty sick. Like that show. They tried, they stretch it out a lot. They're like, is this a killer? And it's like a six, it's like a six inch fish. Oh, has this fish really killed people? Like, no, dude, it's six, it's fucking six inches long. I don't think anybody's ever died to this fish. Does it have, uh, does it have any window wipers? I don't think so. Uh, I have one big eye. Thank you for the 50 months. Thank you. I have one big eye. Appreciate that. How's it going, dude? 